Oh, yes. Begin casting Earth Lore again. We should probably stop producing spearmen, considering I can't afford to feed them. Okay, so what was next on the docket? I forget. Oh, yes. The armory. Because we want to produce slingers. Let's see what's in here. A great drake. A great drake can squash an entire army of spearmen. And I only have one. A great drake could smash an entire army of slingers. A great drake is very powerful. In fact, generally speaking, this game does not have dragons. Instead, it calls them drakes. Uh, in the pen and paper game Dungeons and Dragons and a lot of things, uh, drakes are generally known as smaller, smaller versions of dragons. But in a game with no dragons, essentially drakes become dragons. So in that place, you could basically say there, or basically say there was a great dragon waiting for me, and uh, I don't think I can take that. I don't even th think I can take a a uh, normal version of a dragon, or a crappy version. Okay, well, I have met the blue. They have an outpost. I want to find their main city and kill it. As fast as possible. These are the panels, uh, or the wizard panels. There's four of them. Or he calls it a, a gem. The wizard gems. You use these to talk to other wizards, or negotiate with them, but none of them are filled in yet, so I don't know whose town this is, but it is the Blues. Yes, 11 turns. Okay. Oh yeah, am I? Yes, I'm still casting that. Very good. Okay, well, there could be... No, I can see the shoreline. There could be a bridge over there, but probably not. The shoreline doesn't move, so... It's safe to say that I'm on... some sort of an island. It's a big one, that's for sure. I wish I could get over to those other towns and destroy them, but... water's in the way. I've been looking over at it a lot. Thinking... well... I either need to summon a flying creature, or I need to build a boat. But building a boat takes a while, so... First, we're going to focus on these people that are actually on my island. Tis a shame. Alright, I think he's got to be somewhere over here. <laughs> no, I was wrong. Well, maybe he's in this direction. Continue casting Earth Lore. A very good game, or a very good spell to start the game with. I was saying that backwards. A very good game to start the spell with. It's a very good spell to start the game with, especially if you intend to make some early conquests. Which is exactly what I intend to do. I intend to destroy my opponents as quickly as possible. Aha! <clears throat> we have found Raven's Fortress. I have identified it as Raven's Fortress, but I cannot talk to Raven. can take over this little outpost. I doubt there are any troops reinforcing it. Or at least there's not going to be that many. Oh yes, we have discovered their city, so now it's time to produce some hellhounds. Hellhounds are fast, they move two spaces a turn, and they breathe fire. And breathing fire is a good thing. 
Okay, well, they had time to produce some, some spearmen. I also have spearmen. I will not tolerate any interference from you. I'm sure you won't. Doesn't matter if you tolerate it or not. You're going to receive plenty of interference from me. Oh yes, and now it's time for me to tell a bad joke. That is just so Raven, what he just said there. That That's just Raven. Okay. Now the time for bad jokes has passed. I somehow feel unclean after saying that. Like my standards have somehow gone down. Oops, I... You can move two spaces, can't you? Or... Oh, is... Can, does the desert slow you down? I guess... I'm confused. Moves two. No, the desert doesn't slow you down, I just was inefficient that turn. Okay, well... As soon as that hellhound gets there, or at least the second one, I'm going to destroy that town. Or, well, at least take it over. No sense in destroying it. Five units of spearmen. I can take that with two hellhounds and three spearmen. The armory is completed. And that little devil guy you saw with the armory completion message is... Well, I guess it would be my, my pets, or familiar, or mascots, or something like that. Depending on you, which spellbook you have chosen the most of, which spell type is your primary spell type, you are assigned one of those familiars. If your life, it's a dove. If your nature, it's a snake. If your death, it's a beetle. And if your sorcery, it's a cat? I think I might have got some of those mixed up. In any case, it doesn't really matter. It's an icon. The little devil guy is an icon because I'm primarily chaos. I am Professor Chaos. Not really. Of course not. Okay, what am I going to build? Oh yes, I'm going to build slingers now. Why did I just build that building? Of course, to build slingers. Slingers are awesome. Okay, and I'm still making hell out. Very good. Oh yes, and you may have noticed that this game is essentially a mod or, well, a mod or a sequel of Civilization. It uses a Civilization engine, and it's different from Civilization in a lot of ways, but it's similar in many ways as well. He produced some extra spearmen when I wasn't looking. Oh well, hellhounds can take care of this. What did he just use? Resist magic. Well, I'm not going to use magic on you. I don't even have enough mana to... Well, I do have enough mana for a firebolt. Let's throw that out there. Why not? Oh, that's what that does. It's a... Or no, this counter magic he had on, too. Okay, someone wasn't paying attention. I figured I could just cast him on a different unit, but... Counter magic. Okay, and we want the first strike, so... Or we want to be the attacker, so I'm just going to move up and sit there. And yes, I wasted a fair amount of mana trying to cast that firebolt, so that was a dumb move, but oh well. It's not going to change the outcome of this fight. I'll just have a little less mana. Uh, I'll just have a little less mana later on. Hellhounds have three fire breath with four figures, so each one gets three fire breath. Fire breath goes before melee, so we get to breathe fire on you before you get to stab us back. It makes a big difference because I was able to eliminate the entire unit without getting injured. He 
These hellhounds are just eating these spearmen alive. Yes, normal spearmen are powerless to stop just two hellhounds. In fact, I only needed one unit of hellhounds, but I decided to bring two just to be safe. Alright, no use injuring my... or no point in injuring my other troops. No, I will not raise the city. I have gained one fame and 161 gold. I'm rich! Now let's discuss fame. I can look in my mirror and I've got one fame. Fame allows you to hire mercenaries and heroes. They'll show up. So it's mainly about the heroes, but also mercenaries can be good if they're good units.